So anyway, let's do some cheats. Sardines. Okay, there we go. Thank you to... Shoot, I don't even remember who exactly told me about this one. Let's see. Thought Nipponichi software ran into financial trouble. I sort of... Apparently, that might have been overblown. A lot of people were, like, arguing about it. And I honestly couldn't find a whole lot of specific information on uh, how much financial trouble they're in. But they're in enough that they keep publishing games. Uh, but yeah, thank you, Anthony Asierto, specifically. Maybe? No, that's not the right one. Well, that's one of them. I had a bunch of people be like, here's how you get the, uh, the DLC early. So I just followed their instructions and it seems to have worked. Well, that was one of them, but that was, that was for the, uh, that was for the PS4, which was less useful for me. Let me check. There was somebody else that gave me the exact one. Oh, yeah, it is same guy. Uh, but thank you for that, because now we have access to all of the DLC, which I don't really know if we want to do any of these, because, like, let me look. Bonus rank 13 compared to bonus rank 6, 7, 8? Eh, we might be able to do it. There's a lot here. Do we want to give it a go? Yeah, so what is the cheat I... I just input to do. It, it just unlocks all of the DLC early, which means I might be able to recruit some more uh, story-related characters. Or not story-related characters, some more, like, unique characters as opposed to just the the whatever members. So let's do new party, passionate interview. Let's see if we can do this. Belvatoris and his party were able to defeat... Uh, mm, spoilers. Okay, never mind. Not doing that DLC yet. I mean, it might not be a problem, but... Spoilers? Let's just rush through the game. It'll be okay. I've been doing some off-camera grinding anyway. Uh, let's see. So, at this point, my characters should be considerably stronger. Uh, let's see. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Oh, right. We should probably also level everything down really hard. Yeah, you'd likely be underleveled for those. Maybe. I'm pretty... Like, I've been... I've been grinding. A lot. Eh, maybe not that much. I've been grinding an amount, reincarnating the characters a bunch, and we've got some decent equipment on them. It still might not be enough. Anyway, death and measles net. Death. One, uh, only one is 45. The I thought 45s. A world supported by fear energy that is harvested from the human world. The demons here obey only one thing. Power. They are divided into different areas, depending on their own personal power. Valvatoras and his party's first destination lies in the lowest level of the netherworld. It's an area inhabited by demonic weaklings and lowly peons. It's been a while since I've smelt the foul air of the netherworld. The sound of screams echoing in the distance, the blood-soaked ground, the warm air, oh, the sweet memories. Yes, the first time we met, during the Golden Age, when my lord reigned over this world as its tyrant. This place hasn't changed a bit. Ugh! Enough of this sappy crap! We need to hurry up and correct the false news reports! Desko, listen up. If you want to keep being my little sister, you need to act more girly. Girly? But Desko wants to be a final boss. Yeah, but that doesn't change the fact that you're a girl. I don't want to have a tomboy for a sister. Uh, okay, then Desko will be girly. Good, then let's start with skin care. UV rays are your biggest enemy. Make sure you're careful about that, okay? Yes, sis! Desko thought that heroes were her only biggest enemies, but Desko will add UV rays to her list as well. The hell are you two talking about? 
So this is it. I heard they went through quite a transformation since the last time I've been here. But I didn't expect this. <laughs> its appearance isn't the only thing. They have the most advanced security system that was designed by the Science Bureau. No matter how small or strong they are, no demon can crack their security. It's pretty much impossible. Even if that demon is a final boss? They still couldn't do it. Have you heard of the Angel of Avarice? She can't even get through here. The Angel of Avarice? Who is that? It's a name that was given to a thief who apparently is an angel that steals from major banks and wealthy families. An angel thief? Ugh, what has the world come to? It's a good thing this is just a dream. The human world is definitely on the verge of its final corruption. Celestia must be going broke, since few humans have faith these days. Anyway, we successfully made it through the security system, which even that angel couldn't get through. And it's all thanks to me. Huh. Feel free to thank me all you want now. However, how is a dead person able to get through such tight security? Does anybody else see some contradictions here? Yeah, but I'm not dead. Soon, everyone will see that I'm still alive, and everything will get all ironed out. Please wait, everyone! A final boss can't walk so briskly! It's one of Desko's weaknesses! Sneak, sneak. <gasps> Are you a Prinny? Uh, yes, I sure am! I, I mean, yep, dude! I'm on the staff here, dude! So, please excuse me now, dude. Oh, sure. Desko better hurry, too. You guys look rather suspicious. How did you get inside the building? Desko is not suspicious. She's just a girl who's training to become a final boss. Yeah, how could you accuse us pretty girls of being suspicious? Are you blind? I'm not a pretty girl. But I came here to complain about an article you bastards wrote. There's a typo! Fix it immediately! No, no, I'm just forget these idiots. And, hey, and take a close look at me. I'm Sir Death and Measel, the president's one and only son. As you can see, I'm still alive. Our orders are to eliminate any suspicious individual on site. Everyone, get in position. Uh, hey, wait, listen to me. I'm the Netherworld President's only... Nonsense! Our duty is to remove all intruders! It looks like they have no intention of listening to what we have to say. Damn it! What's going on? How could this happen? Alright, what are we looking at? No entry. What? Oh. Eh. Just pointing out that I push my knees out of its socket, their sockets when I cross my legs. This is a possibility. Anyway, let's kick, kick the shit out of some things. So, uh, let's see. So, like I said, been doing some grinding. I actually have no idea how strong I am. I know somebody had said, like, you don't actually need overgrind in this game. But to that I say, sardines. Uh, let's see. Like, this is quite possibly going to be one of the few JRPGs that you actually... During any story mission, you probably won't see me be challenged by anything. And you know what? That's okay. It's all the non-story stuff that, that's going to be difficult. Oh, really? Alright. I guess I'll use Gonzamon. Now, I will admit there's a couple of things that I have not done. Uh, namely, all of my non-story-related characters pretty much got the backseat treatment. 
So, this guy sucks. But that's okay, I only need him to just bust that. I guess I could have maybe lifted that, and I don't know, who cares? Okay, evil sword, Balmung. You bad attack. Okay, do I really have to go the long way around here? Oh yeah, so I do. Can I like shoot them from afar? It looks like it. Shame none of my characters are particularly good at ranged attacks. Here I come. I mean, she's got this, which I guess works. Everybody else is not so hot at it. Ow. He is now dead. Oh, right. I turned everything... I'm gonna slow everything down. I'd sped it up, for obvious reasons. But I don't need to... I don't need to speed it up anymore. Oh, right. The, nin the ninjas are harder to hit if you're using, uh... Ooh, canine attack. That's convenient. Well, now we got some ranged attacks at the very least. Bam. Uh, let's see, what was I going to say? Shoot, I forget. Can't, gotta hit ninjas in melee. Or, if you're me, you just don't care, and it seems to work. I don't know, we're winning. That's all I really care about. Well, I missed. Anywho, come at me! Kill yourselves faster so I may win this mission. Oop. This clearly isn't fast enough. And that's a problem. Oh, well, Evil Sword Balmong! I realize I should probably use Buka uh, with Desco, considering they are s sisters. But like, nah. Here I come. That's less fun. Bomb bad stick. Chocolate. There they go. As a big ass sword, would you say that it's a? A appropriately final boss sword? Because I'd say so. Also, wildly unrelated, but we were at uh, Trader Joe's earlier today and we picked up. Uh, let's see. It's. What's the exact flavors on that shell? Guava passion fruit. Here I come. Yogurt. It's like a tangier strawberry. It's really good. Ready, ready, ready. I don't think I've ever had that yogurt flavor before, but it is absolutely a yogurt flavor that I go for in the future. Uh, Here I come. Right, I can do this. Hitting the ninjas is the hardest part. Killing them is easy. Why does everyone attack with food? Why, why waste chocolate on the enemy? I mean, hey, I have no idea what those those things are functional as. Ugh, they're strong. Shall we continue? Let's fight until we can come to terms. I can go all night if we have to. Hey, hold up! Stop fighting and listen to me. I'm the Netherworld President's only son, Sir Death the Measle! I'm the boss of all of you! Huh? A measle? I read an article that said he's dead. I even heard they already had the funeral. Funeral? No! That was rather prompt. I'm impressed. Henceforth... No one will believe your story now. They won't even have the slightest interest in it. Uh, what difference does it make if they're interested or not? I'm 
not dead, I'm still alive. Why don't you believe me? Why is it so hard to believe that the news was wrong? I don't know. If the president's son was still alive, don't you think they would have mentioned it in the newspaper? So you guys only believe what you read in the newspaper? <laughs> How big of a loser are you? They won't believe it, even when you're standing right in front of them. Are you really the president's son? Desko's starting to wonder. Shut up! This must be a mistake! Well, see ya. We have to go report the intruders to our higher-ups. Hey, hey! Wait! <laughs> they have complete faith in the news articles that were issued by the Corruptament. Have they given up the ability to view reality with their own eyes or to think with their own brains? Unfortunately, that's bound to happen to the masses. That's the reason information can be so easily manipulated. It's pathetic. Any source of information can alter the truth to their advantage and conceal or change any news that's harmful to them. Any information that is floating around the netherworld nowadays can be overwritten by the corruptment to their favor. Damn it. I'm not gonna stay dead. They will believe me. They will know that I'm alive. Well, should probably go heal for a bit. Unfortunately, magic changing into weapons always increases. Oh, hey, we have pirates now. I should probably go look at that. Claim prize. Uh, let's see. We're going to look at this, but I'm probably not going to do anything with it. Pirate editor. Oh. Yeah, we'll leave that for later. Oh, on one. Death and measles, death, rotten core. There they are! Intruders! This is your big opportunity. Make sure you show them that you're still alive. Rascal, your very existence is a fact. Go out there with confidence. Oh, I, I know that, damn it. Just watch me. I got this. Can't you see this? You low-class demons! Look at the skull mark on my hood! This proves that I am Death and Measle, the only son of the president of the Netherworld! Right here! Me! I'm Sora Measle! Look! I'm still alive! You sound so desperate. Oh, to be young again. Aw, Desko is jealous. She wants her own trademark, too. N no way! Sir Amizel? Yes! It's me! Oh, cool. They finally believe me. Psych! Did you really think I'd fall for that? How dare you tarnish the name of poor, dead Sir Amizel, you impudent brat! Hey! But I am a measle. See? Uh, the skull? That looks too generic. I don't think they're gonna buy it. Hmm. So a trademark should be unique. Desko will take note of that. It is unforgivable to take the death of the president's son lightly. You are hereby sentenced to death. What's wrong with you, Rascal? You can't change anything by looking down at the ground like that. You were killed once by their false news, and now they'll kill you for a false crime! Are you going to allow that, Rascal? Shut up! And stop calling me Rascal! I'm Death and Measle! Fine. I'm gonna prove to them that I'm still alive, even if I have to drill it into their brains! 
That's the spirit, Rascal. How thoughtful of you. You possess such an undemon-like quality. It is one of your formidable powers. All right, and it looks like we have nothing but ninjas. Oh, I love it when this happens. Come fight me. So here's the question. Do we have Death and Easel yet? Nope. We most certainly do not. I was kind of hoping he'd join the party. He'll join it at some point here. Just not entirely sure when. Oh. Why is that guy super injured? I don't know. Nor does it matter. Uh, we have like no AOE, do we? I guess I'm gonna just keep leveling that up. Uh, can I check the status? Oh. Avoid all attacks from the front. I was wondering what it was. Okay. I was having a hard time trying to figure out what exactly uh, is causing them to have such a high accuracy or high evasion rating. The answer is, oh, duh. Well, mm, flying V strike, flying V strike. Here I come. And what about you? I mean, Balmung. Always Balmung. Big sword! I thank you. Big swords are cool. I kind of want that girl's penguin hat, dude. Dude, I love a penguin hat like that. Like, I don't think I'd want it to be as big, because I think it would look goofy outside of, like, an anime setting. But I'd be super down for it, uh... Go right here. I should be able to hit him. Glorious hitter. This is it. I've never paid attention to that animation before. That's a good animation. I like that. Okay, I have no idea exactly what's the backside for these guys. I'm sure we'll get it. There we go. Match me further. I feel like you sent her to suicide. What? Fuka? Nah, Fuka. Fuka's fairly strong. She's she's no Fenric or Velvatores, but like grand scheme of things, she can get work done if she wants to. Still needs some grinding though. But that's that's okay. Here I come. I wish you didn't skip through all of them. That's you just love the animations. I I guess I'm just in a really impatient mood right now. Uh effectively this entire day has been spent mostly just waiting. Uh like Sparklight was the only game that I actually really wanted to play today. Uh but that bugged out, so I was just like, ah, I'm gonna wait on this one. And now I've mostly just been waiting for Pokemon and, uh, I've been waiting for, for Pokemon and, and Star Wars, uh, Jedi Fallen Order to come out. And so, like, between that and all of the, like, game failures that happened today, I'm just like, nah, gotta go fast, gotta go faster for some reason. I don't know. I can slow down a little bit. Damn it. If this skull doesn't do the trick... What else can I do? Do you see how superficial your authority is? At least you got through their security. If you want to, you can just go home now. You don't have to say it like that. You're the one who told me I could clear up the false news if I came here. Well, I lied. Now that we've gotten past their security system, we don't need you anymore. So, so, so you were only using me? That's right. You were used to further the achievements of our Lord's regime usurpation. You should be honored. 
You tricky bastard! <laughs> You're flattering me. Oh, uh, then does that mean the report of my death won't be changed? Have you been paying attention at all? We came here to take control of this place. Once that's complete, we can easily correct the false news. I, I see. Then we just have to defeat the chief of the bureau. Wait, that's right. The chief. I just have to talk to her. The lackeys only know what the newspaper tells them. But the chief should be another story. I'm gonna let her know that I'm still alive! She should be able to overturn the false news! He's failed every attempt he's made so far! Doesn't he ever learn? Inflicting some trauma might help him learn something, shall we, Big Sis? Well, nah, I don't think we need to go that far. All right, as usual, go back and heal, and then go from there. Wait, death and measles death. Total fabrication. I also like Desco. Desco is my favorite. <laughs> Did you just see that? I think I saw a printy. No, my lord, that was probably just all in your head. Hmm. In that case, it's fine. Are you the ones who were tarnishing our dearly departed Sir Amizel's name? Bastards! You fools are all being blinded by the newspaper's lies! I won't forget this! I'll prove that I'm still alive once I get to talk to the chief! Mm -hmm. I'm gonna report this to my father, and you'll all get busted down to the mailroom! Using your father's name again? <sighs> so pathetic. He's acting like a spoiled peon. Being around him is bad for Desco's final boss training. Rascal, why did you come here? Wasn't it to prove that you exist? Or did you come here to reclaim your identity as your father's son? What? For both, of course. My existence and my identity as the president's son come as a set. Is that so? Haven't you realized that your existence can easily be erased without your identity? Why don't you leave your father's protection behind, stand up for your own free will, and take a step forward with your own two feet? It's the only way you'll ever be able to prove you exist. Oh, shut up! I don't need to be preached to by a printy instructor! I'm the Netherworld President's only son! I'm gonna report you all to my father to receive severe punishment! Severe punishment. Hmm, good luck with that. Okay, bull. Oh, that's an issue. That's a I'll mild issue. Here I come. Sardines! Yeah. Okay, so he's still invincible. Here I come. Here which I would come. be a problem if they could do damage to me. They can't. So, not really feeling the hurt here. Why is he always just egregiously injured? I keep going to the medic. Why are they still stupid hurt? Desco's fine. I don't really even know. Okay. I wonder if she ever loses that dialogue. If she ever realizes she's not dreaming. Or do they just like commit to it and she just never figures out that sh this is sort of real?
Oh yeah, by the way, these plant things are absolutely dudes. Despite the weird weird stuff on their on their pecs. They're dudes. Freaking Japan. What would we ever do without you? Uh let's see. Can I lift the block? Nobody can lift the dude. Alright. Suck it, dude. Oh. Wrong direction. Bango. Here I come. Yeah, I remember when I found that bit out. That was weird. Not that weird, but like... Why have... I don't know. It's not worth questioning too much, but I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I'd put something on my nips. For most reasons. I guess like, if I was running a marathon, okay, I could, I could kind of see putting like medical tape on so I don't like super chafe. I remember, uh, well, I, I've known quite a number of friends that actually do, uh, marathons and stuff. And one of them was, came back and hadn't done so in, oh boy! It did not look good. That's really all I will say about the matter, because, whew! Let's see, they might just be born with those. Maybe. I... Zoom in. Yeah, maybe. It just... Odd. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, right. I actually have to I chuck this, don't I? That's annoying. Puzzles. What's she doing? She's doing fine. Alright, end turn. Alright, really slow. Oh shoot, some of them can hurt me. Only barely. It's kind of weird, because like, Disgaea is almost always this like, odd all or nothing game. When it comes to damage. I mean, it's not that odd that I I am taking damage, it's just... Unused to it? Question mark? Because I've been doing... I've been doing a lot of, like, light item world stuff. I'm, I'm starting to try and pick up, uh... Innocence? Residence? Whatever the, uh... Whatever the people inside your items are. I'm trying to start unlocking brokers and stuff so I can actually, uh... Oh wait, hold on. Uh, let's see, I just want to lift this up and throw it slightly further. Right there, there we go. Oh, and there. She can move. I'm not mistaken, this guy is still invincible. Get out of here. Okay, I'm just gonna have you right, lift the block. Let's look, give it to her. That's slightly better. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Residence in the first one. Okay. It it, it might be still residence. I'd swear I saw innocence as well. Oh. Huh. Oh no, she didn't heal. Okay. Move him forward. Bango. Okay, is it's a really awkward angle for seeing Velvatoras. Here I come. Get off my block. Fortunately, somebody else is gonna. No, no one got on top of it. 
Okay. I'll try and at least, uh, show... Can I throw it on top of him? No, I can't. I'm gonna try and at least show the special, ef uh, special effects and special attacks. Regular attacks I'm gonna keep skipping, though. I was just trying to think of how I how I do want to handle that specifically. And here's the question: Will it round up, or the answer is no? Eh, got some of them. All right, please die. Oh yeah, my resistance stat is hot garbage. That's like the one. That's that's the one true problem. Oh, we lost Desco. No, Desco. This is fine. I think. Let's see. Is Beauty Queen Etna in this game? I actually don't know. I have the DLC unlocked, but I haven't looked at it yet because. Uh, let's see. Oh, can she still attack? She can. Uh, I haven't looked at it because it has spoilers for the main plot and potentially other characters. And so I didn't want to, uh... I didn't want to attempt it. And these guys are actually capable of hurting me. Not much, but it still does. How do you gain more bonus in these games? It feels like you always get really low scores compared to the reward list. Uh, so, for the most part, it's pretty hard to get bonus. The easiest way to get bonus that I have seen and encountered is mainly through... Can I get that out? Eh, I kind of can. Uh, easiest way I've seen is through the geo blocks. Uh, we can do an item world run at some point and I can show you, you how to get like a whole bunch. But, uh, especially in the item world, you might have a bunch of those geo panels. So red, blue, green, whatever. And by by matching them all and then deleting those panels uh, all in one sequence, you more or less instantly max out the meter and get everything on the bonus list. There's some other ways to do it too, but that's the way that I'm used to doing it. Let's see. Can I do head splitter instead? Okay, head splitter will kill him. And there we go. A combo and geo stacking to clear a world. Yep. We can never make an L round. Wait. Okay. Appoint judicial minister. By the way, the information bureau is run by the corruptor mint, right? So, couldn't the false news have been spread intentionally? What? Wh what did you say? Hmm. I didn't expect that idiot to notice. Do you think that you may have already been abandoned by your dad? Oh, what are you talking about? I'm his only son. Father would never... But you're kind of a failure. Oh! That's not my fault! Deflecting responsibility for your mistakes? How pathetic. You should start over as a prinny. Were you abandoned because you're so weak? In that case, you're just like Desco. I'll give you a little bit of my sympathy. Oh well, I think this experience will help you grow stronger anyway. I was pretty much neglected growing up too. Kids grow up to be tougher when they have harsher upbringings, you know? You say that so casually. Were you abandoned too? Uh-huh. I mean, it was basically the same thing. He's the worst dad ever. Big sis. <laughs> A bond among neglected children. Looks like our party is knitting together tighter than ever. Yes, my lord. However, I'm not sure if this is the kind of bond we're looking for. Hold on! I didn't say I was abandoned just yet! 